Today we're going to be making succotash. We're going to be using lima beans, which are fresh in the market right now. Delaware grows a lot of lima beans, and right now both lima beans and fresh corn are in season. This is my favorite time to make this recipe. We're going to be using lima beans, fresh sweet corn, zucchini, and tomatoes. Lima beans are an important source of fiber. They also have calcium, potassium, and they're just delicious, especially when you get them fresh. If you get them fresh, you're going to have to shell them to start, and then you're going to want to boil them just until boiling, and then turn them off and let them sit a minute until the outer skin gets nice and soft. After they've cooled down, then you want to remove that outer skin by just giving it a little pinch at the end and then a, by just giving it a little pinch at the end and then a little squeeze and it pops right out. But you can also use frozen lima beans as well. They're frozen at the peak of freshness and they're especially delicious. If I buy the frozen, I like to use the baby lima beans. I have about three tablespoons of oil in the pan and first I'm going to add the lima beans. I'm going to saute those. For a few minutes. Without browning them. After they've sauteed for a few minutes, you want to add your red onion and your zucchini. Give them a toss. Let that saute for a few minutes. And then you want to add your blanched corn. It's already starting to look beautiful. Succotash is a wonderful dish to make with all the vegetables that are in season in the garden right now. This is just a basic recipe. You can also add a few other vegetables if you like. Sometimes I add peas. I've also added asparagus to this and it's especially delicious, especially when it's in season. You wanna keep everything moving so it doesn't brown. Today I'm also going to add a few green beans from my garden that I've French sliced really small. This keeps the succotash all the same size. I'm going to mix everything up so it's all coated with the olive oil and continues to just saute lightly in the pan without browning. You want to keep everything firm and tender. Now it's time to add the tomatoes. I add the tomatoes last because they're wet and it's going to make everything else sweat in the pan. So you don't want to have too much liquid generated. You want to add them last. So everything is still nice and firm, but tender. Saute this on medium for about five minutes, and then it's done. And there you have it. Fresh succotash using all of the vegetables that are in season from the garden. Tomatoes, zucchini, green beans, fresh corn and lima beans from the market. It's a delicious side dish to have with fish, chicken, or beef, or just on its own. It's packed with vitamins, minerals, and fiber. A taste of Delaware's best.